G'day Wayne, Hayden here at Pacific Toyota giving you the personalized high definition virtual tour on our Toyota Hilux Rugged X. Uh, mate, before I run through the Rugged X, what I thought I would do is show you who Pacific Toyota are. So mate, if you haven't been here before, this is us up here in Cairns. Uh, mate, and here at Pacific Toyota, we actually have two premium used car locations. Now between the two sites, we generally stock in excess about 180 to about 240 vehicles at any given time. Um, mate, this is what we class as our, uh, our city site. We're located roughly five kilometers from Cairns Esplanade. Now, if we follow Mogwai Road, which is just out here in front of me, about two kilometers up into the suburb of Bungalow, you will come across our secondary site, as well as our two brand new showrooms. So we have Toyota and Lexus up there, as well as our service and our spare parts department. Uh, about five kilometers around the corner from them, we also own Hino Trucks, Opus Lock Full Drive Accessories, and Coral Motors. Uh, mate, to give you an idea, we are actually the largest uh, pre-owned department for Toyota in Queensland, um, and we're the fifth largest in Australia. Uh, for our, our, I guess, used car department, uh, we generally sell about 230 vehicles every single month between the two yards. Uh, but mate, without further ado, we'll jump straight back over to the Rugged X for you, um, and obviously show you through the car. Uh, mate, I will start off, we do have two remote keys for the vehicle, um, they are the genuine uh, key. Um, but mate, what we'll do is we'll pop the bonnet and we'll walk around the vehicle um, going through all the paint and panel work, uh, through all the interior and obviously all the instrumentals that come with the car as well. Alrighty, so starting off around the front, pretty generic uh, look with the Rugged X. So you do get that um, lovely steel bought bar, bull bar at the front um, and fitted in that is obviously that light bar. And we do have our Rugged X decals on the top there. Paint work wise, mate, it's in pristine condition through the front. Um, there's no visible dents or anything like that, which is perfect. Pop that open, give you a look inside the engine bay. As you can see, mate, nice and tidy uh, through the engine bay there, which is perfect. Close that one down. Uh, again, through the front bar, as you can see, pretty, pretty aggressive stance. And underneath, uh, we do have the Toyota bash plates and two recovery points uh, through the front. Uh, Toyota genuine snorkel um, on the side there. And then the all famous Rugged X uh, alloy wheels with the uh, black insert and the, the silver outer. Uh, mate, they're wrapped in a Toyo all terrain um, open country tyre. And as you can see, heaps of tread left on them, which is perfect. That's your recovery points just there. Showing you down through all the panels here. As you can see, mate, straight as, there's no visible dents in any of the panel work there. Paint work wise, uh, pretty much equally the same, I believe. Do you have your running boards through the bottom? There is one slight little mark just here. And a couple of really light scratch marks just there. We do have the stone guard for the side. Coming through to the rear of the car now. Again, steel bar at the back here. Bit of marking around the, the back here. Again, recovery points at the base. Mark at the uh, side there. And then obviously inside, he's obviously had a uh, holder for a gas bottle. Looks like he's had a 12 volt set up at some point. And then a, uh, we also do have a kick ass uh, fridge slide there as well. Um, and then this one also comes with the rack on top as well as the uh, King's uh, or Adventure King's um, pop-up tent. All right, we'll show you down the passenger side now. Again, showing you through all the panels, mate. As you can see, nice and tidy. There's no visible dents there. Looks like a bit of a mark just at the back here. Paint work wise on this side again, pretty much in the same area, just a couple of light scratch marks there. Most of that should just buff out. Other than that though, everything else seems to be nice and tidy through the exterior of the car. Uh, so showing you through obviously the second row of seats now and obviously inside we've got all the tent poles and pegs down the base, air conditioning vents through the rear, and then obviously all our uh, Seats, all the leather's all in really good condition. Rubber floor mats throughout. And then we'll jump inside the car now and show you through obviously the uh, cockpit of the vehicle. All 
Alrighty, so we'll start the car up. Alright, so current kilometres on the vehicle, we have 23,522k showing on the clock there. As you can see, no warning lights on the dash, um, so all in really good condition. Um, over here on your steering wheel, pretty much all your um, normal mod cons, so uh, stereo and Bluetooth. Then over here, all your cruise control options and center screen options. So cruise control down below, all your center screen above. Push button start, and all your window controls and side mirror controls just here over on the uh, right on the door card. Uh, across to our infotainment system, nice large display screen there with a reversing camera. I'll turn that one up so you can hear it. Alright, so as you can hear there, all um, all speakers are working nicely, there's no distortion, no crackling or anything like that. Uh, air conditioning, um, which is a climate control setting, so you can actually set your ideal temperature. Uh, and then down below we have your 12 volt auxiliary port, uh, USB and AUX. Um, not that we need it up in North Queensland, but heated seats, uh, left and right. And then we have your traction control, your downhill assist control, and uh, this vehicle does come standard with a rear differential lock as well. A couple of cup holders just there. Obviously, all your um, driving modes, and then all your um, eco and sports, or power mode, uh, four wheel drive options, so two high, four high, and four low. Bit of a hidey hole in there. Now that is ventilated as well with the air conditioning. And then our service history, the vehicles, so we need to get to the services. All right, so we have first service at six, 11, 14, uh, 20 and then 23 and that's got a full Toyota service history with the vehicle uh, Rubber floor mats, which are the genuine Hilux floor mats throughout and obviously all the leather um, Is in really good condition as well. So interior wise almost immaculate um, inside um, What it might do we'll turn the car off jump on out and give you a final look over the vehicle I do apologize for the delay um, in the video as well uh, Mate, end of month is always crazy. So trying to get all the cars out in time for end of month. But uh, mate, that is our uh, Toyota Hilux Rugged X. Uh, mate, I hope you enjoy the video. If you do have any further questions though, please don't hesitate to give me a call and I'll look forward to hopefully uh, doing business with yourself soon. Cheers.